It's not as easy as you think. It's not something everyone can do because you're having someone fall in the air and it's pretty dangerous. A lot of girls have gotten hit or oh, one girl broke her nose. Cheerleading is an intense sport that requires athleticism and determination. Many even consider cheerleading more competitive than other high school sports. Personally, I think it's more competitive. I think um, gets a lot. there's a lot more stress and everyone wants to win. It's a lot of hard work and commitment because it's all year and it's expensive and you have to be ready to practice three times a week. We have six coaches, so they're all for different things, whether it's tumbling, dance, stunting. Our head coach has been coaching for about eight years, and we'll need one staff advisor in case someone were to fall. Cheerleaders feel proud to be on the team, as not everyone makes it who tries out. There's about 80 that try out, and only about 25 make it. Practices are usually three hours and can start as early as seven in the morning. When one person's not there, you can't stunt because each person plays an important role. Four people in a stunt group. There's two base, which carry and lift the flyer, which is in the air. And then there's a back in case she falls backwards, is there to catch her. Really dangerous, especially back handsprings because it's all in your elbow, so if your elbow gives out, you're you fall on your neck, which is not safe, which has happened, and it's pretty scary trying to do it again after that. For a stunt group, if one person is not doing it right, then the whole stunt group will fall, and there's about six stunt groups in a team, so if one stunt group falls, that's five points, which can make a difference between first place and last place. Drama also can arise from competing high schools. There has been times where other schools will you'll get into a fight, not so much physically, but verbally. And a lot of cheerleaders won't talk to other cheerleaders on other teams, just because either we have beaten them or they've beat us and we want to win and it gets pretty competitive. Hammersfield High School won first place at the 2010 Ontario Cheerleading Competition. Well, yeah, there was a lot of pressure because Last year we were undefeated throughout the year and then this year um, at the first competition which was Triple SAA we lost, we came in third and uh, which we've been, we had a winning streak of five years at Triple S so when we lost that we really wanted to go and prove that we could win regionals which we did. Uh, well usually on Wednesdays and Fridays um, I'll cheerlead till 6, but then I'll have other commitments after school and I'll have to go to dancing and all these other things. So I am pretty busy and tired by the end of the day. I'll be one of the seniors on the team, so I'll have a lot of experience and I'll be able to help out the younger girls and hopefully we'll be able to um, stay undefeated. I really enjoy cheerleading because you make a lot of new friends, you get more involved with school, spirit and it'll make high school go by quicker because you'll have more fun. So the next time you see cheerleaders, think twice and give them the respect they deserve.